Greg Powers here, Dave Campbell's Texas Football, and I'm joined by Class of 2026 cornerback Jermaine Bishop from Willis High School, one of the top 2026 prospects in the entire country. Recently hit double-digit offers. Congratulations on that, first and foremost. What's it like to have all that attention? Yeah, it's a really big blessing, you know. You just got to stay positive, stay humble. Great mindset. You got some guys here at Willis to kind of look up to, pattern your game after, but also like watch them go through the recruiting process. You got DJ Lagway committed to uh, Florida. You know, you got Amari Holmes on the, at wide receiver. You, you know, even DeBron Hampton and, and, you know, some of the other guys, you get to watch them and see how they attack it. What are you learning from them? You know, how to stay positive, you know. I tried to get a big head. And, you know, just like, when they were going, they didn't have, like, nobody to help them, you know, with the recruiting process. So, young guys, like, just hauling their footsteps and them you know, being ready leaders helped me a lot. How does it help you in practice to match up with, like, top-tier talent every day and sharpen your skills? Oh, it's great, you know. Everybody, you know, iron shot with iron, so everybody's going at it, getting great reps, it's getting competitive. Um, Under Armour Camp, DB MVP at such a young age. DCTF Rising, top 25, you was in there as a freshman as well. Um, do you feel like that kind of puts a target on your back, and do you like do you like having that target? You play, like, with a chip on your shoulder because of it? Well, he must definitely put a target on my back, you know, but, like, I just don't let that stuff like that distract. I just keep playing, keep my head in the game. By the time he signs his name on the dotted line, he's going to have 30, 40 scholarship offers probably. He's got 10 right now. Who was the first offer? What was that day like whenever you got it for you and your family? Uh, the first school offer was um, University of Houston, and I was in basketball practice, and I called out, and it was just like a great conversation. He told me, and like, just changed my whole, just changed the rest of my life forever, and me and my family. What was that night like? Did you guys go out like for a celebration dinner? No, we didn't go out for celebration dinner, but it was a great night, you know, a great question for me and my family. That was the home state school. He's got some other big offers that have come in. Another school in state is Baylor. They're in the Big 12. What do you know about that program? What do you like? Like maybe when you took a visit there, what do you know about Dave Miranda and his squad? You know, Coach Curtis was like one of the great coaches that um, helped me a lot with that process. And um, they were a really great school, great coaching staff, a great football team. And I went out there more and see how it really is. Florida's another school that's offered you. DJ Lagway is going to be playing his ball there. I know he's probably already in your ear trying to like tell you all the great things about Florida. Have you had a chance to like go down there and see that program, or what do you know about the Gators? No, nah, not sure, but I know they got a great coaching staff from what DJ has told me and what I've heard. Who else should like we keep a close eye on so far? Like it's early. Like look, he's going to get them all. So like, who else should we keep a close eye on? It's like maybe, maybe they put a smile on your face when they are. They also the grass as well. Got you. What do you think about the Longhorns' chances as they move into the SEC? Is that like a, a, in the future in your mind? Can you see yourself in a Longhorns jersey playing the SEC against an Alabama, against a Georgia? Well, it must have a real big stage. I, I think I'm ready for it. Um, any programs you're hungry? Who's out there that like if they if they offered you a scholarship, that'd be like a big life changing moment. You know, you got Georgia, the national championships. Any anybody pop to your mind? Probably LSU. Growing up, you know. Bishop right here is a class of 2026. You have to remember his name. He's out here at Willis High School. Good luck as you go through the recruiting process and of course as you go through uh, your seasons here at Willis High School, the Willis Wildcats, who are underneath a huge, you know, huge change of culture with Coach Miller, Trent Miller here at Willis High School. Jermaine, thanks for the time. Nice to meet you.